Hey, how's it going, guys? Uh, Fest here with Favorite Photos. So today we are shooting in Hollywood Beach. It's a little different today. Things came about like last night. It's a little challenging, but I always like a challenge. We've got a model here. The challenge is that we didn't know what the clothes were, what the outfit was gonna be. And the concept came together very last minute, and we don't have an exact location that we're shooting at. And we're gonna move around a little bit and shoot. I always thought that that's a good challenge to have as a creative. And I know a lot of people do that um, as far as like meetups and stuff like that. But it's a little different when you're you're trying to get quality images that are going to be able to use for modeling agencies and you're having to do it that way it's not just a creative you know aspect of things you also have to very be be very mindful of what the industry standards are and how you can apply that in the setting so it's gonna be really cool a model just getting here we're gonna go through her outfits and see what we can pick out all right so tell me what your favorite one is that you definitely want to shoot in i always like a model to start out with something that they're most comfortable in just because it brings out their confidence and, and it's easier for me to start out with the shooting process. And I have an idea what I want also, so um, with the concept in my head, I pick out something that complements it. And then we're gonna go out here and start walking around and try to find something that works with the outfits. Use the fence to kind of help you with the relaxing outfit. Yeah. And maybe put this leg out a little bit, yeah. I try not to overpose a model, but um, I just make a few adjustments. Um, and over here, it was just her leg. And I like shooting in um, sunlight for this, uh, for this like concept even play at least. With your hair, like you're fixing um, it with both arms? Yeah, look out. I just like the um, harsh clear. sunlight nice. just because of the uh, contrast okay. of the highlights and the shadows that it gives you. And I also like using a uh, one, two, three method nice. when shooting in harsh sunlight like this. Three, two, one, open. And turn over to your right. Love these. And uh, change up your arms for me a little bit. Maybe drop one. Yeah, there you go. She's a pro, so it wasn't too much I had to do as far as uh, posing her. And then over here on the second look here, I wanted to get a Cuban vibe, like being in Cuba somewhere, somewhere outside of the US. So we found this building, love the colors, um, used the dress to complement it a little bit better. Um, and it, it does give a nice Cuban style shoot. And then we went on, this was actually an impromptu kind of thing because we didn't plan on doing this look, but we saw a guy with a tennis racket and a tennis ball and we asked if we borrow it and she had the outfit for it. So we just ended up shooting this. Oh, I got hands. <laughs> um, we got some great images there, especially since all we were getting ready to shoot was swimwear, but we ended up with that. And then sometimes the model borrows your outfit or yeah. your hat in this case. Um, we wanted to shoot a couple of lifestyle stuff that her agency needed. Um, so we started with that and she borrowed the little chair that I usually sit on. And yeah, whatever you can do for the shot. And then we ended it with uh, swimwear. Uh, it's kind of challenging because it was at the time of the day where there was a lot of people there at the beach and I don't really like too many people in the background for me so you can see I'm on my knees here um, just shooting on that upward angle that way I get more of the sky and less of the people if you like what you're seeing guys um, just leave a comment um, subscribe to the channel let me know if there's anything else you'd like to see in the future and I'll make sure I get that out to you